Now we cross borders to the Democratic Republic of Congo, where Congolese President Felix Shisekedi was sworn in on Saturday following a disputed December election, promising to unite the Central African country during his second five-year term and protect lives in the conflict hit Eastern region. President William Ruto led a delegation from Kenya to witness the inauguration ceremony. President William Ruto led the delegation from Kenya that attended the inauguration ceremony for Congolese President Felix Sisekedi as he started his second term as the President of Congo. <laughs> President Ruto, in the company of Prime Cabinet Secretary Musalia Mudavadi, joined other presidents from the region in Kinshasa for the ceremony. Former President Uhuru Kenyatta had arrived in the country earlier and was also among leaders attending the ceremony that brought together thousands of people. <laughs> Shisekedi took the oath of office in a stadium in the capital, Kinshasa, packed with flag-waving supporters, government officials, African head of states, and foreign envoys, including from the United States, China, and France. In his speech, he acknowledged the nation's hope of better living conditions and economic opportunities. Around 62% of Congo's 100 million people live on less than a dollar a day. Tisekedi won re-election with more than 70% of the vote, <laughs> according to the Electoral Commission. However, opposition candidates and their supporters questioned the validity of the election, which was marred in logistical problems.